Hello guys, I am Flash Isaac and today we shall be dealing with this chemistry question. It says catalytic hydrogenation of benzene produces dash. It means that um, when we add hydrogen to benzene in the presence of a catalyst, that's what we refer to as catalytic hydrogenation. Now, benzene is an organic compound with alternate ca uh, carbon to carbon double bond. It is a very stable compound and it is difficult to break that bond in benzene. But at high temperature, let's say uh, 300 degrees Celsius and pressure, let's say around uh, 30 atm, we can hydrogenate benzene. So this is benzene for you. See, that's cis carbon. One, two, three, four, five cis. And there is alternate double to double carbon bond, which means that this is carbon to carbon single bond. The next one will be double bond. This is carbon to carbon single bond. The next one will be double bond. This is carbon to carbon single bond. The next one will be double bond. This is benzene, or you can represent it with something like this. So here, this is carbon, 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 and this is the alternate double bond. That's benzene. Now, the remaining are hydrogen, H, H. And remember that carbon is tetravalent. It can carry four um, electrons. So one, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, three, four. So it's complete. Now, when you add hydrogen to benzene, let's say three H two O. Look at it. This is in the presence of high at high temperature and the presence of finely divided nickel. So let's say finely divided. Nickel, let's say at 300 degrees Celsius or so. Now, when you say finely divided, once a solid is finely divided, it means powdered form. So, finely divided nickel means smooth nickel or powdered nickel. In this, with this condition, this we have uh, 3H2. Now, remember, we have alternate double bond here one here, one here, and one here. This means that one of the hydrogen. Will break here, so you form one H here. One of the bond here will break, so meaning here will not be three bond one, two, three. It will need one to complete, so here will be one, two, three. It will need one to complete, here will need one to complete, so one, two, three. It will, another one will break here, so here we now have another hydrogen. The catalytic hydrogenation of benzene has now given us something like this so single bond throughout and cis carbon. So this is simply cyclohexene. So this is cyclohexene. So this is the product of the catalytic hydrogenation of benzene. So hope you found this helpful. If so, feel free to subscribe to this channel for more amazing videos. And don't forget to check out my previous videos. There's obviously something there for you. Thank you for watching.